Hi, I'm Ian with the League of Women Voters of Texas. On November 7th, there will be an election covering several proposed changes to the Texas Constitution. One of these proposed changes is Proposition 10. Proposition 10 would remove property taxes on equipment or inventory belonging to manufacturers of medical or biomedical products. Texas is one of only a few states that applies a property tax on the equipment and inventory of medical and biomedical companies. In Texas, property taxes pay for local government services such as police, firefighters, libraries, and public education. Property tax on other property of medical and biomedical companies will remain. Arguments for Proposition 10 include First, removing property taxes on biomedical equipment and inventory may encourage more biomedical companies to move to Texas, creating high-paying jobs. Second, removing property taxes on biomedical equipment and inventory could strengthen our medical supply chain and may protect the Texas healthcare network. Third, the COVID pandemic exposed the risk of having key medical equipment manufacturers outside of the country showing the importance of supporting local biomedical manufacturers. But there are also arguments against Proposition 10. Because Texas does not have an income tax, eliminating property taxes on biomedical equipment and inventory will reduce funds available for local school districts and local government services. Also, the burden of the tax loss will fall more heavily on communities with biomedical manufacturers. Another argument against Proposition 10 is that reducing property taxes for one industry places more tax burden on other businesses and individuals to support their government and public schools. Thank you for taking the time to learn more about the upcoming election. Please get out and vote.